Warning, the following game contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to Resident Evil Blind. On the last episode, we, uh, we headed off to the West Wing upstairs, past the passcode door, and, uh, we fought a bunch of zombies, we got a pistol, we got a, we got a magnum from the tiger statue, and then we explored that area, and uh, fought a bunch of zombies, got a bunch of books, got a scrapbook, we also got a battery for the courtyard door, and found an elevator, so... We're gonna be heading off to the elevator this episode. I'm still hurt. <laughs> I need to. I need to go. I need to go. Uh, I need to go. Uh, heal. <laughs> I, I couldn't. I couldn't forget the words. I should have. You know, maybe taken a break. I. I don't know. I'm very loopy after the last episode. It's. It's not the scare. I'm just. I'm just goofing off, saying that that's true. I don't have a gun in my hand. Why? Why don't I have a gun in my hand? No, we're in, we're in, we're in, we're in lizard person territory. Let's equip this. Well, we're heading, we're about to head upstairs. There's nothing around here. Probably just could have kept the gun out. I know there's green herbs on the way, so we'll grab those. Find out what's on the other side of this elevator. And then, I don't know, run for the hills. <laughs> there's a helipad we could probably reach. I'm very curious to see where the story's leading. We still haven't found any sign of Chris, despite the fact that we've been pretty much everywhere. So, he might either be dead or he, like, left completely. Maybe he betrayed us. That'd be kind of a cool twist. I mean, we had the ability to play as either Jill or Chris. What if the person that we chose was evil? Although, why would he betray us? That's the whole thing. Maybe he just left. Let's use this. All right, I'm almost better. I probably should have combined it. Uh, you know what? It didn't matter. I still haven't tested what green and blue do together. If I can even do that together. I right, have the elevator, but there's the there, there's this right here. You know what? We're fine. Let's just save this just in case we get hurt. This will be our backup. You know, let's get the bazooka out. Why not? We don't know what we're going to fight. <laughs> what, what's downstairs? Ooh, that's creepy. I got this mansion has an elevator. Up that I think I think I say I see something on the ground. <laughs> I don't I don't want to deal with that again. I saw your foot. What is this music? <laughs> I like I was like too worried about this zombie that's lying on the ground here. It feels like something I could make. But -da -da -da. I'm not scared at all. This music doesn't fit. A freezer that is not being used for a long time. Uh, I'm in like a kitchen. Anything inside this kitchen? This doesn't look healthy right here. Oh, that might just be like a. Might just be. Oh, that's just a napkin. <laughs> a gas cooking stove. The gas is not supplied. Thank God for that. Ooh, lockers. Lockers over here. It's dusty. It has not been used for a long time. Can I open them? Nope. There's a microwave here. And a drawer. An oven. It's badly rusted and does not seem to work. Scene was that? <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like a hunter, and I was about to be very frightened. But no, it just turned out to be a normal zombie that could open a door. 
That was a... That was, and then, of course, the stupid music playing in the background. I don't feel frightened at all. This music has really helped me. <laughs> Thank you, game. It's locked from inside. Oh. It's locked from inside. Okay, well... Whatever. Where am I at, by the way? Mansion basement one. Oh, right, so this is the basement. Okay. Well, let's go up the stairs then. Where will, where will this take us? Oh, that looks frightening. The lack of light in this room is very creepy. Okay, there's the elevator. Why is this hallway so dark? Oh, hold on. Where am I at? I'm here. Oh, okay, that's a staircase. <gasps> I can open this door. Yay, I can open this door. And finally, I can go through this door again. Oh! <laughs> okay, I heard a footstep, and I, I was like, what's in this room? Oh, there's another! I gotta... Oh, nope, don't exit! I gotta reload! Here. Wait for this one to die. Oh, it still hit me! Oh, it blew up! That was that was powerful. I got hurt. I did not. Oh, I should still use this. Okay, I'm in I'm in danger territory now. I know what I expected coming back upstairs to the mansion. Alright, let's go to the rope then. If that thing's locked from the other side. This body is completely gone. That oh no. <laughs> I was about to say, maybe that body that like disturbed us downstairs. The one that came through the door and started that cussing was this guy. But his head fell completely off. So I don't think that was possible. Are there any of those monsters in here? Let me just get back to the main main room. What's the quickest way to get out of here? <laughs> I think the quickest way to get out of here would be to go upstairs and then go through the hallway that leads to the back room. And then we... Oh, the, the footsteps scared me. <laughs> like, it sounds like there's something else in here, because that doesn't sound like my normal footsteps. It just echoed. All right, let's see. Second floor. Yeah, through that through that room, back to the hallway. Back to where we fought Yawn. And then we can go down the rope. And then we can find what's over there. I killed the one that was in this room, right? There was room in this room, right? <laughs> I don't want to be scared, please. Okay, I did kill it. Good. I'm like panicking. It's like, where are they at? <laughs> where, Where's all the monsters at? I don't want to fight them again. Did I miss anything? No, I didn't. Just that red herb, but I don't think I need it. I still haven't used a combined thing. I mean, I really haven't been poisoned, so... Other than by Yawn the first time, so... I haven't really needed to cure myself from poison. So where's this rope tied to? There's a rope. Will you descend it? Yes. Please don't... Please don't ruin the rope. Alright, rope's still hanging. Alright. There's a switch below. Will you push it? Who would have this in a mansion? Like a tomb entombed inside of completely empty. Like how? Who would reach this? <laughs> All right, so it is a ladder. Descend this. Oh, that looks creepy. Okay, the fart music's playing again. So I'm back in the I'm back in the basement. Oh, I have to go through this way in order to get through that door that was locked. There's a little there's a section of this room that I can't reach. Oh, okay. <laughs> Normal zombie. All right. So get the pistol. You know what? That's uh, let's avoid that thing for now. Let's go this way. Oh, other normal zombie. Ooh, shotgun rounds. 
Hold on. He's coming this way. I don't want to move because he's probably too close now. Come on, friend. Make yourself known. I missed. That wasn't good. There we go. I wasted a round. <laughs> I thought I could, could be all cool. It's like, I can get him from here. Whiffed. All right, I got shotgun rounds. Oh, that'd be, that's very helpful. I need more shotgun rounds. Am I doing, I have, I have, oh, I need to reload this. I needed to reload that already? Who have I fought? Oh, I fought the zombies in the, in the kitchen. This music is so out of place. Okay, something else is eating something else here. Okay, two of them are eating. I'm just gonna ignore them. They're not going after me, so I don't care. You unlocked it. Well. Is that it? That's it. <laughs> well, you know what? Let me, uh, I was closer to the ending over this way. Let me just, uh, excuse me, gentlemen. All right, so this basement was kind of pointless. I feel like I didn't need to go here. I mean, the shotgun rounds help, but other than that, I mean, I guess I had a choice. I could have either went straight down there and like gone up the, gone up the, gone through the kitchen, gone through that staircase, or I could have just went through the elevator and took me straight there without needing the passcode. Or I could have waited like what I did for Barry because I didn't know I could do anything else and get the passcode that way. So I guess that was, a, that was a choice right there. I could have went either direction. Oh, I wonder if that was one of the choices I need for the good or bad ending or thing. Or multiple ending, whatever. <laughs> I still don't know. I don't know what choices I need to make. I think I was told I hadn't affected anything yet, so... That's thankful I didn't I didn't realize there was one until now. Oh, what am I doing? There's a bunch of, no, hold on. Just equip this for good measure. I feel safer with a bazooka in my hands. Well, let's grab the battery while we're here. And we can put away those shotgun rounds since I don't I don't need them. Oh, I need to grab the crank too. I'm gonna need to I'm gonna need to lower the water. I haven't seen Barry since he helped us with that passcode. I wonder where he went. I like how we're running into one or the other. It's either Barry or Wesker. I mean, to be fair, we've only run into Wesker once. Put the shotgun right there. Let's grab the battery. Let's glab, glab. <laughs> Let's grab the crank. There we go. Did I ever search this? Nothing important. Its end is square shaped. Okay, well, okay, square crank. Ah, uh, so there's another different, there's a different kind of crank. Otherwise they went to simply labeled it like that. I feel like I should, I should search everything more. I mean, I, I did that with the disc because I felt like uh, maybe there's something written on this disc somewhere. I did it with the books and I got the medals. Or the, the book, <laughs> the, the, the Doom book I picked up, and I got that medal. Fourteen minutes. Where's the closest save point after this? Probably in the probably I I probably have to head back to the guardhouse. I have to run through this. I have to run through Snake Canyon again. Woo! <laughs> oh wait, I have the bazooka already. <laughs> I was like, oh! Like, I got I got scared again. I was like, oh, I didn't expect anything to actually be here. I don't know why I didn't. <laughs> Everything's fine. Just a bunch of lizard people. With very sharp claws. Who cares? 
I have to sell the. I have to. I have to go through snake candy because I have to sell the battery from the basement. Stupid dogs! I can hear even though I killed them all. <laughs> all right, snakes! Don't get on my bad side. All right, I have to. I have to go across first so I can go and sell the battery. Then I'll have to come back up so I can go flood this place. I wish I knew where you were falling from. Spooky skin, spooky snakes. Thank God that snake there wasn't cheap and attacked me while my head was passing by. Let me take a look here again. I, I kind of looked here before, but I didn't notice anything. The water is running from the upper water passage. There's something in the back. I don't see anything. At least not clearly. Like, oh, I have the hang of these controls. And I, uh, oh, I just, like, walk in, like, swerved lines. There we go. Got the batteries charged. There we go. Lift works. I don't have to deal with the snakes anymore! Yay! Hopefully they didn't like spawn in enemies in here. It's like, oh you got that part now? Now I'll put in now we'll put those lizard people in this in this hallway now. Just to spite you, Derek. <laughs> Say my name. They purposely were talking to me when I was seven. Yeah, that seven-year-old kid's gonna play this game in 19 years. Let's scare the crap out of him specifically. We get a cool cutscene when it floods back up. <laughs> I guess not. Well, it's flooded. That was quick. Now let's find out what that water was blocking. I don't know. It feels like it's gotten a lot more quieter. Maybe because the running water is not even playing anymore. Was the running water playing in the background? Is that why it feels so much quieter? Or is it just my, like, nerves getting the better of me now? Might be both. Who knows anymore? Okay, come on, Jill. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I guess we need to find out. The, now we know why the courtyard is labeled first floor. There's a ladder. Will you descend it? Where am I at? Courtyard basement one. Yeah. Oh, I don't like this place. There's a door over there. Oh, this looks creepy. Oh, there's a typewriter here. Oh, I don't have any. I don't have my ink ribbons. If I had an ink ribbon, I could save my progress. Uh, uh, uh. Well, you know, you know what? Let's just head over to the. Let's just head over to the. Uh, the guardhouse. Anyway, we're close to that, and that has a save. That has a save spot. I mean, if we're going to have to go grab an ink ribbon, might as well just save it in the save room. Unless there was a box there that I just completely passed by. I didn't even check what the other side of the hallway looked like. I mean, we could just grab it and then save down there. Blue plants. I hope this place isn't like infested with hunters now. I hope this place is infested with lizard people now. I'm very creepy. I'm very scared. I don't hear anything. That's a good sign. Whoa, 
well. He manages to find a basement. That was about it. It wasn't really a productive episode, was it? Well, we found two basements, I guess. We found the basement for the mansion, which just turned out to be that. <laughs> that seems to be all that there is. Uh, I didn't mean I didn't see a map or anything. There's just some zombies and a kitchen and fart noises being made by someone in the background. But we didn't put the battery in the courtyard. Unflooded that thing. Took, oh, I guess that's a ladder. I, I was wondering what that symbol was. Into what seems to be like a cave system underneath. Which looks very creepy, so we'll have to find out. We'll definitely be going through there next episode. Let's grab an ink ribbon. There we go. Nope. 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 Come on. Come on. Nope. <laughs> okay. There we go. <laughs> did, I say, did I say I was getting a hang of these controls and I was lying? Guardhouse. <laughs> Alright, so, on the next episode of Resident Evil Blind, we are going to be heading through the courtyard basement. God, everything has a basement here. Oh, let me go back to the map. <laughs> nope, that's the guardhouse. That's the courtyard first floor. <laughs> go through the basement. Oh, that looks. We'll find out what's there. We'll find out what's at the end of the hallway and right by the ladder. And, uh, might, well, I mean, might as well bring some ink ribbons with me. I don't I don't know if there's... Yeah, you know what? I'll just keep ink ribbons here. So, until next time, hopefully you enjoy. <laughs>